I'm Skylar Nicholson, and this is your Grady Daily. An Oconee County in for parole, Aaron Wright committed a murder in 1988 that involved decapitating and amputating a victim's hands. While serving time, he also escaped and evaded police custody. He's been serving his life sentence since 1990 and now has a possible consideration for parole. This happens to all inmates who are sentences with involving parole and who have served at least 14 years. UGA has been awarded a $3.5 million grant from the National Institute on Drug Abuse. Now, this will allow researchers to study the effects of medical cannabis on chronic pain. The research will be focused on how cannabis treatments compare to traditional pain treatments. Now, the School of Public and International Affairs will partner with the College of Public Health and the University of Minnesota's Research Data Assistance Center on this initiative. Now today, the Board of Regents is meeting to talk about a new possible first-year residence hall off of Baxter. The preliminary budget is set at almost $50 million. The opening date for this new housing commons would be set tentatively for 2022. The new housing facility would also allow for an extra space for students to be housed, while other spaces are being renovated. A vote is scheduled for next month. And that's it for your Daily Gritty. For more Northeast Georgia news, check out our website, or if you're on the go, our new mobile app. Thank you for watching and have a great afternoon.